transmissible venereal tumor. Experience with dog in Goiás, Brazil, shows the success of autohemotherapy in cancer. Fabio Borges de Souza. Autohemotherapy as assistant therapy in the transmissible venereal tumor. Monograph presented at the core specialization, La Tosensu, in clinical medicine and small animal surgery UCB, to obtaining the title of specialist. Advisor, Professor Dr. Lila Maria Leo Parenti. Guinea. Brazil Abstract The transmissible venereal tumor TVT is among the major neoplasm that affect dogs. This is transmitted between animals by direct contact. The transmission of infected cells is usually during sexual intercourse, but can also occur through the acts of lick and sniff. The most affected breeds are the Rottweiler, Labrador, Alaskan Malamute, German Shepherd, Boxer, Doberman, Akita, Cocker Spaniel, Samoyed, Siberian Husky and Dalmatian. In females, the TVT is located most frequently in vagina, vulva and extragenital region. In males, occurs almost entirely in the prepuce and penis and can also provide the extragenital region. The characteristic lesions of TVT are usually ulcerated masses. As the process evolves, take looks similar to cauliflower. The diagnosis is usually established by clinical symptoms, and the physical examination showed the tumor on the external genitalia. TVT responds to many forms of treatment such as surgery, radiotherapy, cryotherapy and chemotherapy. In general, the prognosis of TVT is favorable, except for cases of metastasis or resistance to chemotherapy. Another alternative treatment indicated for TVT is autohemotherapy. The process consists of the removal of blood by venipuncture and immediate administration, intramuscular or subcutaneous. It is noteworthy that in this case, the donor and receptor are the same patient. Autologous blood may also be a source for medical ozone therapy in addition to their recognized use as immune modulator. The explanation of who defends the technique is that, when re-injected, the sick blood would not be recognized by his own body, causing the reaction and activation of the immune system. So, a study was conducted using the autohemotherapy to treat a dog with TVT and the results obtained indicated that this treatment may be used for this kind of cancer, reducing the number of doses of vincristian sulfate necessary for the resolution of the process.